we all know Sonic's a beloved viewing franchise, sort of, according to what the fans say, but I still enjoy it. I still enjoy these games, and I thought Sonic Forces and Sonic Unleashed were pretty good games thrown at me. But the best part of these Sonic games are, of course, the songs. The songs are some of the best songs created in this generation. And those who say video game music isn't real music, well then you can just go eat it. Because when you'll hear the song on this list, you'll be begging to hear these soundtracks. So let's get into these favorite Sonic songs. This is my top 15 Sonic songs. Let's get into it. Number 15. Fight the Night from Sonic and the Black Knight. Now, what you say about the game, it's like probably one of the most hated Sonic games ever made. And it's a pretty divided game, but you gotta admit that the song in Fight the Night is pretty good, pretty catchy. It builds up a nice after two when you fight the night, and. This is these, like, really cool medieval instruments. Point, and by Crush 40. Crush 40 is probably one of the most iconic bands, and it doesn't get enough love, in my opinion. But this game is, this song is really cool, and, and a really divisive game. And as for that, let's move on to the next one. Number 14. All Hail Shadow from Sonic 06. Now, say what you will about this game. I made an entire video about why I think this game is so heated. So, if you want to go watch that, go watch that. But, you gotta admit that this song is pretty catchy. If I was to rank the Sonic 06 team songs, that's what I'm gonna call them, I would rank Shadows. All Hail Shadow as the first, the Sonic team at like second, and the sh and the like Silver team at the third. Because this song is just. Awesome. Crush 40 rocks us up again. Even though the game was bad, you gotta make the song pretty catchy. This song just. We did not all hail Shadow enough. Because Shadow is a badass. He's awesome. He's my favorite Sonic character. It's just that. Whoop. This song is just all hail Shadow. It's a nice rock theme. If you wanna go to a band concert, play this song, and maybe some Sonic family will recognize it. Anyways, on to the next one. Number 13. Fist Bump from Sonic Forces. Now, I don't know how people felt about this game. I know people hate this game, but I gotta say, this game was pretty awesome. I got this for Christmas if you watched my Christmas video gift. But, um, yeah, this video, this, uh, this game was pretty good. I know people hate the, like, classic Sonic conclusion and how Sega is milking it, but the song was pretty great. It has a nice war aesthetic. The care, it has a pretty good, like, soundtrack. Just imagine if, like, Crush 40 would this song. It would have been awesome. But hey, let's move on to the next one. Fist bump. Boom. Number 12. In short words, Team Chaotix song is a pretty underrated song from Sonic Heroes. Again, if I was to rank the team songs in this one, Team Chaotix would be first, um, Team Sonic would be second, Team Rose would be like um, third, and Team Shadow, I mean Team Dark, would be um, fourth. Because this song is just underrated as hell. It sums up the Team Chaotix perfectly from their... Um, uh, what console were they on when the was on? I don't remember. But yeah, this game was pretty, the, like, Sonic Heroes is known as a pretty, like, cool game. But this song is just cool. It sums up the Chaotix perfectly. So, Team Chaotix, don't mess with them or they'll kick your Chaotix. Anyways, up to the next one. Next up, number um, 11. Aquatic Minds from Sonic Adventure 2. No, Sonic Adventure 2 is considered the last good Sonic game. <sighs> yeah, right. But this game is, but this 
Sonic game is pretty good, and the uh, Quantum Wise theme is the best track out of the whole thing. Well, we'll be getting to the best track out of all of them when we get there. But yeah, this song is incredibly chill and relaxing. I read this comment in the video, and I said, remember when um, Knuckles used to be black? And that had me laughing as hard as it could be. But yeah, Knuckles is like black in this game for some reason, I don't know, and it's my, and every track you go on, there's like this cool rap song, and this is the last Knuckles rap song we'll be seeing on this list, as there is another one, but yeah, this song is pretty chill, I highly recommend looking up, looking it up. Next up at, um, uh, number 10. Number 10 is Lazy Days from Sonic Adventure. Now, this game is kind of like hated, but I think it's a pretty good game. Sure, the cutscenes may be lacking, but so this game is pretty good. And I don't know if you think Big is a good character, but I think he's a great character. But yeah, this game is. This character is. deserves like more love because he's overheated. And his song is pretty good. I don't understand why people like it. I was jamming to it, I was jamming pretty hard. Big user, so much love, and Lazy Days needs more recommendation. Next to number 9. Unknown from M. Point E. Or Master Emerald. From Sonic Adventure. Another Sonic Adventure song on this list would be. And remember how I said that that Aquatic Minds was the only song was the only Knuckles song on this list? Well, this is another one. I really love this song. Knuckles is just straight up badass. He's rocking them lyrics. Although there's one inconsistent lyric where he says, "I don't chuckle," but in song three he did chuckle, so the point is valid. But still, it's a pretty cool song for a cool character. Until Sonic Boom, at least. But back then it was cool. Um, number eight. Sonic Heroes opening. Yeah, I remember I said that Team Chaos was in the last Sonic theme. Sonic Heroes theme. This is one of them. This song is just awesome. It displays each of the team's abilities and it displays what characters they are. The teams in this the teams in this game are awesome. The the graphics are awesome. The like little flash of metal song was cool. You see all them huddle up is just all oh, so amazing. I definitely recommend watching this opening. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. Next up at um, uh, number seven. Send the scene from Sonic Mania. Okay, yeah, I know. This is a fan made song, but I can't help it. This song is just so incredible. And that was maybe my top ten YouTubers list. I would have definitely top ten YouTubers videos. I would have definitely included this song. Because this song is just awesome. It's great. And there's way more love. This create this animator and all the animators put so much passion in this song. I definitely subscribe watching this song. It's so awesome. Next up at number six. Again, another family again, another family song. Well, it's a lyric song. So that it seems that fans are making better stuff than Sega nowadays, I'd say it. But yeah, this song is just great. It's colorful. It's just very soulful, and the singer put a lot of heart into her lyrics. And we move on to the next step at number five. Of course, this song would definitely be on the list. Because this song is just legendary. It's a cult classic in the Sonic fan base. This song is just imaginative. It sets up the danger of the journey ahead. But it keeps it fun and creative. The truck chase was great. Also, I really love this. I really love Crush 40. I don't know if Crush 40 wrote the song. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. Sonic Colors. Reach for the Stars. This song is just imaginative. It sets up the build of the game. It sets up the threat. It sets up you saving the aliens. It shows all the cool powers. And most of all, it shows off how cool Eggman's, like, Eggman Land is. Hey, let's move on to the next one. I am Olney from Shadow the Hedgehog. 
Now, I don't know how people feel about this game, but I think it's better than Shadow, All Hail Shadow. This song is just edgy, cool, but in a fun way. It's just so, like, thematic. That's what I love about Old Sonic. It felt so thematic. I mean, video games have thematic scenes, but this song is just so thematic. It's so edgy, so goth, it's so cool. As Rebel Tactic would say, goth me up and feed me this more song, because I love it. Now, Next up, at number two. Live and Learn from Song Adventure 2. This is one of the, this is probably the best boss theme music to any game ever. It's so, it's so awesome. It's cool seeing Shadow fight good, and it's nice seeing them use their super, super saying forms to defeat Giant Salamander, but it doesn't compare to number one. And now we hit number one. This game is as cool as fudge and beards. This is the best Sonic song ever made, and no one can tell me on that. This song is just so cool. It builds up the suspense of seeing Chaos and all the Chaos animals, and Super Sonic goes Super Saiyan, and it just zooms right past them. This song is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And nothing could ever top it in my eyes. This song is the best thing to come out of our generation. I will ever go down as my favorite Sonic song ever made. And I'm sure as we go on, there are going to be more favorite Sonic games and Sonic songs out there. And who knows, maybe there will be one that crushes, um, open your heart. But I doubt that will ever happen. Haha. <laughs> but yeah, this isn't the only Sonic video planned. I've got some things since the Sonic news coming up next month. So see y'all then. Bye.